Hey everybody, I'm Silocat, and I'm here to play Mist. Alright, on this episode, we're going to go through the Mechanical Age. We're going to explore the island and solve its puzzles. This is an ongoing series, so make sure you hit that subscribe button and sign up for notifications by ringing that bell. Want to experience more content? Well, check me out on Twitch Tuesdays and Thursdays at 10 p.m., or you can check me out on Thursdays at 8.30 on this channel as we do a Jackbox party night. I'll put a link to everything you need down in the description area. And now, it's time to play Mist. Alright, here we are in the Mechanical Age. If you remember, we got here via the gears on the dock on the main Mist Island. And of course it's nighttime, so we are going to switch on our flashlight. That way we don't get lost. Okay, well this is interesting. Okay, I'm just going to cycle through some of these buttons. Okay, not too many there. And of course that doesn't do anything. Let's see where we can go. Okay. Okay, I'm going to cross this bridge. It looks like we have two ways we can go. Alright. Well, this is a very nice and ornate room. These are significant or not, but we will write them down. Okay, and now back to the main part of the room. See what else we got. Nice little chest board. A lovely chair. And a wine glass. That's kind of cute. Here's a uh, picture of that rocket ship that we went on earlier. And look, here's another of the, uh, the sunken ship. There's a clock. That's kind of a throwback to the main Mist Island as well. Um, and, of course, we don't see much through that. I don't know if that's because we have to do something, or if it's just nighttime outside. So let's continue on. Okay, kind of a nice little central room here. I'm not sure if we can do anything let me travel around so let's go ahead and go back there was a button I would like to press that mm, that looks nice once again nothing we can really do with this so let's go ahead and continue. Mm, okay. It's a little bit darker of a room.
Looks like a secret panel. Yeah, okay. Oh. What's this? Okay. Fortress Rotation Simulator. Okay, so I guess we are in a fortress. Oh, check that out. Not sure what this other one does, but that's okay. That's kind of dark. Looks like uh, maybe a little bit of electricity there. Hmm. Oh, check this out. Blue page. Awesome. So I wonder if that other room had a nut. Oh. Okay, well, that's kind of creepy. I wonder if the axe. Chop head. Okay. Stop getting distracted. I wonder if that other room had a uh, secret passageway that we could look into as well. Let's see, and this looks like, you know, so this is the beginning, so it's one big giant circle. See if we can find the red page in this room. Yeah, that's well hidden. All right. Secret wine stash. It's creepy every time. Can't open any of these. Oh, there's the red page. That's really hard to see. Okay. So let's go see. I'm pretty sure we've exhausted everything in this that we can do. Um, I don't want to give up on this yet. I, I do think that this is something. Oh, you know what? I think I missed this before. Huh. Oh, check it out. There is a little indicator here. You can't see it because of the flashlight. But it looks like it might be related. Yeah, look, it's turning. Oh, I missed it. Okay. Anticipation. All right. I wonder if now we'll see something different here. Yeah, okay. So we now have a new place we can go. Let's close this. So it looks like there is a midway area that we can go into. Oh, 
really not much you can do there. I wonder if we can press that button and get out of the elevator. This would be nice if we could tell what we were doing. But it's dark outside. So this is like power on. And this is rotation. a sound. I wonder... Okay, so if we remember our trip through the, uh, the underground area in the last episode, we had those same sounds. That clanky sound was a south, and that piston was an east. So I wonder if that has something to do with this. If we go that route, then the next one should be a ding. Oh. Maybe I didn't go far enough. Okay, so it sounds like it's going to be the same same thing. So we're going to go ahead and start with north, because that makes sense, and see where that takes us. this feeling that this whole area has rotated based on everything I have seen. Okay. And I would believe that I am right. So let's see what we have here. Okay. Well, that looks like that pedestal at the very beginning. And I'm going to venture to say that the first two codes are going to be those and we'll have to turn this fortress again to get the other two codes so let me write these down and we'll be on our way okay well now we can kind of see what we're looking at this over here looks like that's going to be our next spot so if this is north then that means that south is probably where we came in and that that would be east so let's see if we can rotate this guy to east turn on the power Okay, that was west, so let's go ahead, we'll have to hold it down for a little while. Okay, let's assume that we're 
parked south now. And uh, east. Okay. Let's give this a try. Yes. Okay, and now we're going to go ahead and record these, and then we will be on our happy little way and find out what that door up at the beginning did. Okay, so we've got to go a full three quarters turn so we can point south again. Just guessing here. Okay. Quite far enough. All right, now we should be facing south. So let's go ahead, exit, find out what we need. Find out what's beyond that door. Awesome, back here. All right, let's input the code. All right. Awesome. Turn off. Hey, it's another miss book. We turned off our flashlight and we can see it now. All right, well, this was actually a really quick age. Okay. Blue page, blue book. <laughs> I see. Convinced the Cirrus is guilty. Pray, do not release him. He will destroy me just to see you. Innocent bystander. I've been wrongfully tricked into imprisonment. Okay, still a little bit staticky. But that should clear itself up here soon. Let's go grab that red page and be on our way. Gold bars and a red page. Okay, here we are back in the library. Let's go turn in the red page. See if uh, Cirrus over here has anything different to say. With each page I can see more clearly. Soon, be free from this horrible prison. This book. You must visit the one remaining age. You have not. Okay, still staticky, but that's all right. Let's head on over to the ship. Oh, 
this way. Okay, gonna head on over here. Let's turn on the flashlight so we can see what we're doing. Ah, one last book. So this will be the Stone Ship Age, which we will cover in our next episode. Everybody, it's been great having you here. I really appreciate you coming out and watching the show. And stay tuned till next time when we will cover the Stone Ship Age. <laughs>